K-I-L-R Killer Games Hello gamers and simmers, and hopefully the return of some pilots. I am the Killer Gamer, and uh, we are here at Aurora Municipal here in Illinois in Flight Simulator 2000. <clears throat> yeah, a couple episodes ago we had a pretty nasty landing, and last time when we came to this airport it was a little better. So, hopefully I've uh, won some of you back. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we are heading to Clow. Let's go ahead and pull that map up. And we'll show you where that is all at. Here's Aurora, and here's Clow. Um, I guess we could set our radios, but why? We, we can do a flight planner. <laughs> Uh, we've done set radios for the past several old uh, flight simulators, so it's kind of like, uh, it's getting kind of tiring. Uh, let's see here. What does Clow have? Let's see, I'm taking a look at, you can't see it, but I'm looking on airnav.com to see if they've got like a ILS or anything. No, no RNAV GPS. Nope, they don't have. Do they have ATIS? Do they have anything? They nope, they don't have anything. Okay, well that's that's fine, fine, fine. That's fine. Okay, so we're gonna go to runway nine, and then we'll load up our flight planner. <laughs> Turn everything on here. Whoops. Huh. Yeah, in the last episode, I was uh, fighting with the elevator trim, so the plane was going all over the place. Okay, so we are going south. This is not the runway that we want. There it is. That's the one we want. <clears throat> this is a very bumpy taxi way. They need a better pavement. Maybe it's made out of gravel.
Huh. That's not the end of it. If you listen closely, it sounds like the aircraft is like... Oh, I don't know why I'm trying to line myself up. <laughs> Once I load the flight planner, it's going to change that anyway. Okay, here we are, and I'd say we've got everything set. Nope, flaps are up. Autopilot on. Oh, geez. It would help if I turned that part on. GPS. Nav. So we are headed to Clow International, just like we did on the previous simulators. And this FS Clouds is absolutely, man, that's just ugly. That's assuming that is the FS Clouds, and uh, that's not normally how it looks. set my head heading bug let's see right about
whoops right about there so what I'm looking to do is head off like this and then make make our way into Clow. I see five. I thought it was a different. Oh, I thought it was a different uh, identifier. Imagine if we were taking a Learjet. Probably would be there within five minutes. It's like... <laughs> this Beach Baron is quicker than what I would have thought. Turn our speed brake back on. turn that autopilot off this time. I think... I think that's it. I wonder if all the airports have that water tower.
Man, I got the speed brake on and we're still going fast. What is up with that? Well, we're out in the dirt or grass or whatever this is. <laughs> that looked like about a. That looked like that was about as wide as a sidewalk. Man, where am I going? I'm like going back and forth and... Whoa! I... Jeez. I gotta fix that. <laughs> My thing disappeared. I hit my, my thing there, disappeared. I must have hit something. So now I have this small little gap in my, uh, <laughs> in my dashboard. It's made by Apple, it has a notch. Well, I was coming over here to park, but I guess we can get fuel. Not that we really need any. filled up. Alright, so here we are. Clow International. Man, there doesn't seem to be a whole lot of uh, dynamic uh, aircraft and stuff, does there? I guess it's only at the major airports. Oh. Man, still need some practice with this with this Beach Baron. Maybe it's just hard to fly on the Flight Simulator 2000. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just getting some rough landings. I can't get this thing uh, to slow down enough. So, ah. well, you know, hey, that's what the comments are for. If you've got some suggestions, what am I, what am I doing wrong here? I need. What do I need to do to get this thing to slow down? Because it's it just comes in so quickly. And I know this probably doesn't make it easier, but you know, hey, I don't exactly have the money right now to get a c 
control yoke. All right. Um, thanks for watching, and I will see you on another video. Be sure to check out the other versions of this flight because it's not just the old ones. I do have the, the newer ones, too, coming out. So, like Flight Simulator 10 and X-Plane 11. All right. I fly better on those. <laughs> All right. See ya. If you thought this flight was interesting, then you might want to check it out on these other flight simulators that you see on your screen. It's just a fun way to relive old memories and see how things changed over the years. Be sure to subscribe to be notified of any new videos, and I'll see you on the next flight.